before we do that, can we speak about this, please? Do you guys remember when I played this clip in the last stream? Um, it's courtesy of the final kiss subreddit. It says, if you ask Papa who would win the fight between himself and Joe Rogan, um, he would say himself, he, you know, he took two minutes to tell me, well, oh, let me go back again. If you ask Papa who would win the fight between himself and Joe Rogan, Papa had to hold himself back for two minutes before he said he would kick the shit out of Joe Rogan. So this clip was posted on the subreddit recently of Brendan talking about some guy asking him a, uh, a hypothetical question about who would win in a fight between him and Rogan. And this is his reply. How would you do in a fight against Joe Rogan if kicks weren't allowed? And I went, excuse me? You know, he was a car show. And I went, what? And he goes, but if kicks weren't allowed, and I go, well, so in a boxing match? And he's like, no. And I go, wait, why wouldn't kicks be allowed? He's like, well, because Rogan's a really good kicker. And I went, right. I said, <laughs> dude, nobody loves Joe Rogan more on this earth than me. I absolutely adore Joe Ask Rogan. Ask Joe that question. I look Joe, uh, Joe's, you know, my North Star. He's the best, one of the best human beings I've ever met. I said, but you got to realize, dude, when you ask that question, you might as well, that's like me asking you, how would you do uh, in stand-up compared to Joe Rogan? And, and you're an open micer and Joe's a professional. He goes, what do you mean? I go, can Joe kick? Absolutely, dude. For a guy who's never competed professionally, he can kick like a motherfucker. I mean, if you put him against any celebrity out there, he's going to beat the shit out of him. Black belt jiu-jitsu. I don't, I don't think he has any wrestling. doesn't matter. He's jiu-jitsu. He kicks. I don't know how he's boxing. It doesn't matter. Like in that like regular civilian aspect, monster. Yep. I said, you got to realize, though, I was ranked top 10 in the world a heavyweight as in the a USA. professional. A heavyweight in the USA. I said, so it's just different. So the fact that he answered this question for me is proof that they're not longer closer than they once were. They're not as close as they once were. Sorry, let me rephrase what I'm saying. They're not as once as they close, close as they once were. Because I don't think in the past he would have en ever entertained this question. He would have been very differential. He would have been very kind of like... Um, apologetic about it he would have been very, like he would have tried to basically give rogan his flowers or jerk him off or suck him off while also talking about how badass he is but in this scenario he actually was basically saying in a roundabout way i'd fuck rogan up if we had a fight so for me it's proof that they're not as close as they once were well this happened the other day right look what happened today look what joe rogan posted on his fucking instagram today did joe rogan see this clip do you think did joe rogan get wind of brendan saying on his podcast that he beat the fuck out of him because look at what Rogan put on his fucking Instagram. <laughs> so, did Rogan hear what Brendan said? Did Rogan hear what Brendan said? Did Rogan's big back hear what Brendan said and said, all right, cool, you think you can fuck me up? Let me hit this fucking heavy bag. Let me hit this heavy bag and show you what the fuck I could do. Because there has to be something to be that, right? I, I know Brendan was a former professional athlete, a former professional fighter, but he doesn't roll, he doesn't train. If you actively keep training and actively keep working on what you're doing, obviously Rogan's smaller, so you know, weight classes matter. But maybe there's a maybe there's a there's a chance that Rogan could give Brendan some trouble. Because he actually does you know he does keep himself busy he does constantly hear a heavy bag he does roll constantly he's a legit black belt not like a black belt he bought because he's a celebrity so maybe rogan saw what brendan s said you know these guys you know they're very fragile fucking male egos and he's like you know what i need to remind motherfuckers about my power i need to remind niggas out here that i'm really that guy and maybe this is why we have this fucking video maybe that's why fucking rogan's out here beating this heavy bag to pieces and looking ripped while he's doing so maybe that's the reason right maybe maybe rogan saw what brendan said maybe rogan saw what brendan said hmm that's my narrative by the way i'm gonna run with that narrative my narrative i'm gonna run with it my original narrative my organic narrative my non-ngo narrative right i'm gonna run with it i'm gonna run with that narrative <laughs> that's what happened <laughs> I'm going to run with that narrative. That's the deal. That's what happened. Rogan saw it and he went fucking crazy. He's like, you know what? Let me remind people of my power. <laughs>